speaking into our souls. I mean, he, he did it at Combo Breaker. He's doing it here. But man, you guys can see it. This is what we're ending up with here. Our grand finals. It's going to be a race to three. But if Junding wants to win the championship here, he's going to have to do it twice. Yeah, he's going to have to take out Kudons. And the first time these guys met tonight, it was two to one Kudons. But crazy back and forth set, right? John Ding, like three rounds straight or something. And Kudons, three rounds straight, right back. You know, just five rounds at a time. I'm saying, you know, two rounds for you, three rounds for me, sort of deal each way. Yeah, it could have gone either way. You know, honestly, I felt like, you know, Kudon started to open up towards the end of the match. But, I mean, can he do that in a longer set? That's the question here. Because right now, the potential is for a longer set. If Kudans wants to win, he can end it early. But Junding's going to have to go in for the long haul. Yeah, very and that's, long haul. that's going to change a lot of things here in the matchup and how they're going to be playing it out. Yeah, because, so, of, of course, course Junding coming from losers. So if yeah. he wants to win this tournament, he's got to win two sets of first to three against Kudans. And Kudans today is playing ridiculous. That's a tall order. I mean, mm -hmm. you know, hot off his victory again at the European Master event. I think it's going to be really, really unlikely. I mean, I'm saying this, you know, just from the way I'm trying to analyze the matchup and how it's working. He's going to have to chip away so much at what Devil Jin can do. And Devil Jin has the liberties. He can take bigger risks. Oh, yeah. He can take bigger risks. So his punish game not only has to be on point, he has to outthink him in every step of the way. What and if he I just think that's going to be tough. Dashes, back dashes away from the electrics and the hell suite. He can. I mean, but back dashing doesn't do any damage. Maybe he can get the whip. The Maybe. laser scrapers. Because, you know, I mean, Kudans, he's been playing so compact, right? It's, it's first two hits a laser scraper, yeah. down forward one. Uh, down four, up four, four. That's basically it. Oh, down three was. That's it. I mean, yeah. he plays it with a very limited moveset. But what, what, what happens here if Kudans is able to get the early hit, then he runs away and forces, forces Junding to attack. And I don't think that's a good situation to be in. Well, we he is, see Eddie smiles is, all around teammates. Eddie does not have an electric. He does not have a hell sweep either. Yeah, should be an interesting one. But, you know, as I mentioned, John Ding has been doing so well in all these tournaments recently, but he just hasn't gotten the W, right? He gets, yeah. he gets close again here in Grand Finals. Combo Breaker in Grand Finals, but he hasn't been able to close it out and get the W. And, of course, lots of love to our sponsor for the Tekken World Tour, Quanba. Make sure you guys check out their stuff. If you're looking in the chat right now, type in those keywords, and also there's a giveaway. You have your chance to win some of these amazing Quanba products. You guys see Kudans right now using the Obsidian. Of course, he has installed his Korean lever. Oh, yeah, he's been moving that lever around, too. Tried it out in a dragon, tried it out in an obsidian. Yeah. Trying to figure out which one he likes best. And, of course, we're about to start. As you can see on the screen, this is our grand finals. It's going to be a race to three matches, but, again, John Ding has to do it twice if he wants to be our champion. Is it close? Eddie Gordo. Okay. Eddie Gordo for John Ding. I was curious. Like, you know, he lost to Eddie the first time. Maybe he's got this lucky Chloe. I mean, he definitely has a lucky Chloe. He definitely does, but I mean, I feel like it's unlucky at times. Well, you never know, man. I mean, Kudans has lost to like a Noctis in the past, right? That's Kikoma. true. That's true, but that was day one. That, that was day one. I don't think he'll, uh, he'll pick uh, him okay. again. Okay. Anyways, here, here we, we go. go. Grand final CEO. Make some noise, ladies and gentlemen. Here we go. It's going to be Kudans versus John Ding. Who do you like? I know you mentioned you want to see John Ding take it. I want to see John take it. I want to see him get that W finally. I'm going to go with my old Round friend Kudan. Let's oh, yeah. see how this works out. Yes. The pressure immediately throws out like, whoa! Wow. Okay. That, that's not what All I right. expected. He went for some crazy stuff. That's not the Kudan that you know, your old no, friend. No, <laughs> that is not my friend. That's one right way there. to start of a grand final, though, right? Like, yo, get hit by this, this unblockable. You think about it, baby. We might see some artistry. We might see some stuff that we don't normally some see. Some artistry? Yeah. yeah. You know, Mishima play is so rare nowadays. You don't see them at the highest level, especially doing all the crazy stuff. Let's get crazy. Yeah, Kudans with the block. Oh, no. oh All no! Right, it is. Definitely. But it doesn't matter. He got it anyway. He got the round anyway. Scary yeah. moment, round though. Two. That's rough. You got to make sure you punish those. Yeah, if you block a hell sweep, you better launch punish that. You got to make them pay for those mistakes. And look at that. Kudans going for the electric wing. God trying to punish that down for people's four. Knowing the options that he has. Man, Demon Paws all day. Uh huh. Sidewall Techo. Uh-oh. Here's the wall. What's he going to go? He goes for the head, but able to put the brakes on because he didn't want to get punished. And Kudan just chilling, blocking everything right now. Big lead float. Doesn't get anything off it. Oh, again? again where's but the that's launch? not it. That's not what you got to do. You got to launch it if you block those hell sweeps. Round three. Not looking Fun. good. He's, maybe he's shaking up. Maybe he's still used to fighting the other character. He's fighting Dragonov still. It's okay. He's adjusting pretty well here. Okay, get some decent damage here now, pushing towards the wall. Uh-oh, no wall stun though, yeah, didn't type it right. 
Oh, is that how it works? You have to time the second yeah, hit? Yeah, you can time the second hit. It's going to knock down. Oh, look at that, though. Two rounds to one. Jun Ding. Fight. Oh, Kudon's uh -huh. with the Wraith Kick to follow with the Demon Steel Pedal. Nice. Keeping legs into relax. He gets the mid mix up again. And John Ding, I think he's playing far enough away that he's able to just crouch and see what lows are coming. Yeah, and try to react to that, maybe. I mean, it's a bit unfortunate. I mean, the quickest launcher that he has is the wall setting one three, but it is a high, so he's going to have to be kind of wary of that. Hey, hey. And Kudon bringing it back right now. John Ding just a picture here. Death denied. Final round, game one. Final round. And this is a slow play. I mean, Kudon's making these adjustments, closing it out there. That last round, and look at him. He's starting to pick away, using more of that Wraith Kick, trying to install the fear there out of that strong mid wow. And There's the health sweep. That is the mix-up. Yeah, at that time, that could be... And he's low. Yeah, he's not going to sidestep that. He's, he's not even going to try. He's like, my back to the wall. Go ahead. Do whatever you want. I'm not trying anything. Again, with the laser strip. Nice. Hit him with the mid. But, I mean, it's going to take oh, more Open block that. and the full punish from Kudon. Wall's in the way. He's gonna survive this combo. The low oh. kick's blocked. John Dick's still alive. Hit the rage drive! That might be it. It should be it. Yo, John Dick! Game number one! <laughs> he can't even believe he hit it. He's like, I just hit it. Yeah, his consistency and the accuracy of landing that rage drive has been remarkable today. A lot of people will probably say, you know, it's not one of the it's not it's not a good rage drive. A lot of people it's will say launcher. that. It's a launcher! But when it hits though, when it hits, it is amazing. Even on block, it puts you in like for a 50-50. Sometimes. Sometimes. It's a great rage drive. I like it. I'll use it. I think we are uh, in the infinite azure. Mm -hmm. No Game walls here, two. so both players have free freedom to roam here. When we got to the stage, isn't this where JDCR still beat John Ding? No I feel walls? like, yeah, I feel like, yeah. Round one. Anyways, we'll see. This is all going to come down to spacing and movement here. There are no walls to restrict the level of play. Holy moly. Oh, man, oh, he, he caught him. him. He clipped him. Yeah, Back Kudon was trying to sidewalk around so much. Uh-huh. And look at this. Nice damage to open up. And now he has the lead here. Mm -hmm. Oh, he tried to catch him. Beautiful. With the circus. What a bait. John Ding. Oh, boy. Oh. Yeah, but still such a big lead. And John Ding getting the first round again. You know, he's playing defensively pretty sound here. He's not taking risks. He's not whiffing. I mean, that's really one of the pressure tools there for the electric officers to kind of interrupt. Man, look at these slash oh. kicks. You're not going to sidestep those. Yeah, he's like, what are you going to do, Eddie? He's Deal waiting with my for pressure. the jab. If he's going to throw out a jab, I feel like he's going to electric. Break his face. Okay, nice. Again. Oh, oh the crush. And the follow-up here. Good damage. John didn't keep it close. That's the same option he used to stuff every attempt before they played in the winner final or yeah. winner's uh, semis. Beat the mix-ups. Get an option that hits no matter what he does. And man, time wind down very slow for both players. Time 15 seconds with John Ding with the life lead now. Oh, nice block there, but unable to get anything out of it. Oh, Demon Hawk. Kudos can definitely bring this back. Gets the hell sweep as time's winding down here. He can extend this combo as yeah. long as possible just to kill time off the clock. Smart play by Kudon. Yeah, able to time it out, but again, still fighting it. Johnny's gonna have to make some adjustments here. Oh, big counter. Oh my gosh, he missed the combo. How rare. That was served right to him. Yeah, weird situation, but still, Johnny holding on to the life lead. Yeah, it's tough because I you do slightly have to time that afterwards, otherwise the second hit will whip. But I, I mean, maybe he hesitated a bit too much. Yeah, Kudon bets it on the hell sweep. Gets another combo out of the screw attack. Gets the extension. Life bars about even here. A lot of time left on the clock, though. Uh oh, here we go. Oh, got him with the mix about to relax. Yeah, that should be it. There's a follow up down two, three, in the guaranteed three. Doesn't matter. Didn't need it. Mm -hmm. And judging, look at this. He might go up 2 0. So this is going to happen. Healthy. Okay. And continuing again with more pressure. This time, you know, taking more offensive liberties. Bow, 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 bow. Wow. Oh! oh. The blockable armor tackle. Yeah. It's so weird seeing that it's blockable. I mean, continuing the pressure afterwards. Oh my god, he caught him, Ducky. This is going to be huge damage as well. The unscaled last hit of the combo. 
Oh man, but Kudan gives some Demon Steel pedal. He still got the rage. Oh, just the pixel. Oh, he's just out of rage. He gets he the rage drive. But is it going to be all Not with that combo. It. Got the low parry. He has another opportunity. What's he going to do? This combo's not going to kill either. Mix up. Oh, oh. the rage on with the pixel. John D. That was madness. He had no life left. <laughs> oh, I'm so good. I'm so good. I'm so good. Boom. What a madman. That was insane. That was the slimmest of pixels. John Ding goes up he in the grand finals. What if he did something? Did, what if he did something that did more damage? More damage. He's like, I, I believe you, Kudos. You're playing so compact. You're gonna use these small pokes. I can bet this rage art with no help. Crazy stuff. It Crazy. worked out. It worked out. Now he's up 2-0 here in this first set. But I have a feeling Kudos is gonna turn it up. We haven't seen him take, you know, risk. He hasn't done the Mishima blender yet. I mean, he's been going for these health sweeps. Yes, he has. What we haven't seen him do is like a wave dash cancel in a while standing too. We haven't done wave dash into laser scraper. We haven't seen him go for throws either. So we'll see. There are going to be more options in play right now. And again, starting to sidestep as well. Counter hit. Mm -hmm. Wow. Shunting is playing out of his mind. He's going to get the wall as well. Try to spring at the dude. Doesn't get it. Nice, try to catch him, but again, he can't move. Okay, look at his pressure. He has the side of his body towards the wall here. Nice, up forward four. Looking to close it out. Yeah, he is keeping him guessing right now. John Ding doing a great job. First round again. For I really John think that's uh, one of the big changes we've seen as well is the, the notion for Judging to go to instant, instant relax position and force a mix up as well. He's catching him or just watching it, really. That's a great point. And he goes into relax as Devilton like crouch dash it towards him and he health sweeps. Does that even give him a full combo? No. Okay, it's it's not considered, bad. He's considered in the aerial state as well. All right, here we go. He has him by the wall. Demon steel pedal. Look at his pressure. Again, gets the second hit. Oh, he went for the sidestep, but the helicopter kick hit him out of it, out of handstand. Man, John Ding is looking great right now. Kudos has the rage. Can he make something happen though? Really hasn't really been able to put any pieces together. 17 second time winding down. He needs to get something started now. Oh, Gets the hell sweep. The hesitation. Look at this combo. Corpse Still thrust. Blocks his rage. Kudos does rage of his own. 442 smart choice. Oh, Kudos with the lead now. Time's winding down in the punish. He risked it all there with the down back 2 3. But of course, punishable. And here we go. Kudos tying it up in game 3. Dashing in the face. Threatening that rage art or that electric yeah. rage art. It might as well be. It's that powerful, <laughs> right? All right, here we go. Has an opportunity back 2 4. Goes for the screw here. He's going to get the down 2 3. The follow up goes for the riskier version of it. Not guaranteed, but of course, Kudan staying on the floor. Didn't want to risk the mix up. Uses the jab to stuff the handstand. Wave, wave, gets the hell sweep. Again, follow up there with the demon corpse thrust. This oh. time, too risky. No, he misses uh -oh, it. Oh, but just a tiny pixel. And John Ding one round away from a reset here already. Yeah, in a 3-0 reset at that. This is not what I would have predicted. Man, again, Kudos dashing in the face. Threatening that electric. Threatening that hell sweep. And again, he's trying to stagger his wave dash here in the mix-ups. Trying to pick his shots better. Uh-oh, the float. The follow-up here. He has the wall. Okay, going for the sidestep attack. Trying to get evasive here. Oh, look at that. And Kudan's trying to set up some magic there with the sidestep of his own. Das boot. Both of these oh, players look at this play very tight right now. Looking for the reset! John Ding resetting the Grand Finals. Three to zero over Kudan's, what? Amazing, very, very impressive. You know, ha having the ability to win three straight matches here against Kudan's. Now, Kudan's definitely gonna have to change it up. I mean, things didn't go out in his favor. We're going to stage select. Like this is gonna be our final set of matches here in our Grand Finals. Indeed it is. Kudan's gonna stick it out with Devil Jin. John Dink sticking it out with Eddie Gordo. Man, who do you got now? I still like Kudan's in this match. You still like him? I still like him. Well, here we go. We're going to Hammerhead. And of 
Of course, starting it off here again. Now we are at reset. It's 0-0 zero, zero here, the last set of the tournament. All right, crowd, who do you guys like? Do you guys like Kudans? Anyone out there like John Ding? Oh, the uh -huh. crowd. Oh, as oh, soon man. as that happened, Girl's electric like, shut up. Is not on my watch. Uh-oh, pressuring at the wall here. Nice jab in the float, the follow-up here. What's he gonna do? Goes for the Wraith Kick again. He's been going for mids the whole time. Very rarely do we see the health speed come out. Wow, he had him off the wall again. Wraith Drop, this time blocked by Kudan, but a big lead. Uh oh, nice again. He's poking away. He's been using a lot of the lows now lately. He's been using the down back two, the down board four. Yo, Johnny brought it all the way back already. Yeah, just with pokes. Oh, nice. The, oh, he, oh, he missed, missed the it. punish. Big miss there. And now the mid. He's got the rage with Johnny. Bring it back. Oh, Duck the throw. That was so sick. Into the rage. He's like, okay, things are getting a little crazy. Let me calm down for a second. <laughs> that was so sick. He knew that he had him in an aerial state, so he went with the new screw attack. The wall setting went for right into the rage yard. And man, Kudan's wow. able to make that adjustment in time. Yeah, very smart combo considering how close the wall was and everything, right? Yeah. And now the hell sweep. Kudan starting off more aggressive this game. Ugh. Oh, he tried to get him with the, again the Wraith Kick. He's still working those mids. I mean, oh no, it's starting. I think it's starting, Grim. The Blender. He's in it. Yeah, he's into the mix up Vortex. Now, how are you going to get him? Again, still going for the Wraith Kick. But everything. Now, Kudan's defense, where was this? He's like, I know how you play now. The download is complete. Oh, he had a counter hit, had Wait an opportunity. Yo, I think not oh, again. No. He knows. <laughs> okay, that second hit high, able to get right through it. And Kudan's are just like that, two rounds straight. Yeah, he warmed up the electrics. And another Hell Sweep. Hey, you know, if those start landing, it's over. Once Mishimas can get there, oh my Dog. gosh. This is going to be very, very scary because now all the mids are going to be even more scarier. Oh, he gets a counter on the second hit and the follow up. Yeah, full combo out of it now. Yeah, very good low hit. Well, what's he going to do? I, I have a feeling that he's going to go in. What? More health. Oh, he caught him. That was so risky. And beautiful three ring circus punish from Kudan. Rage mode again for John and can he makes something happen again? This nice. time Kudans with the block of the low. Oh, and another hell sweep. hell sweep, yo, Kudans. I think, I think Kudans is ready for this. He's Three feeling rounds himself. straight. Wow, what a statement there. Taking the first game of the reset grand finals. Damn, that was uh, that was rough. That was very one-sided. How many hell sweeps is that, like 10? Doesn't matter, they all hit. They all hit, that's the thing. Yeah, come to think of it, has John didn't even punch the hell sweep yet with the he, launcher? He did in the last set, but he hasn't even blocked one this time. That's the scary part is when you can't block it, that really messes with your mind. That is the threat of the Hell Sweep. Here we go, right back in at game number two. Kudan's up now, one to zero. I mean, he's looking to have back-to-back -back victories here uh, for the Tekken World Tour Master Events. On separate continents? Yeah. He's trying, to collect, he's trying to collect them all. Who give us a cat? Uh oh, here we go. Round gonna start this off. We're gonna see where this is gonna take us again. Kudans is up 1-0 right now. This is the grand finals. The world stage. Oh, this time he blocks it and punishes it with the launcher. There we go. That's what you gotta do. But the thing is, I feel like Kudans is not damage. gonna stop. He's not gonna stop doing it. That's, That's the crazy fine. part. But I mean, at least he's punishing it now, right? So he's getting half a life bar for every time he does block it. Correct. That's what he needed to do. That's a great adjustment. Even though it's something I'm sure he knows how to do and he's known for how to do for a while. Yeah, it's funny too. Like sometimes we're like thinking like, you think he knows how to block it? Yeah, I think he does. Here you go. John Ding answering back. And that time, you know, Kudan, like you mentioned, went for another Hell Sweep. And Johnny actually was about to block it, just stayed out of range. Oh, yeah. Down 4-2, not a counter this time. Doesn't get a launch off it. Looking for that up forward four. Oh, oh man. Slash Ru kick. Yeah, running slash kick again. Uncontested. Very hard to deal oh with. Oh my gosh, they're Another starting. One. But See? that's the thing is, you know, Kudan's not afraid to use it. He's still utilizing it, and I think that's what he needs to do, is he has to take Oh those. my god, another one? Okay, so. Mark, stop giving him advice, would you? Hey, he's not listening <laughs> to me. He doesn't know what I'm saying. But I'm telling you, last match, he got hit by every single hell sweep. This time he's blocking every single hell sweep. See, John Ding's made an adjustment, Mark. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but he might get hit by every single Wraith kick now. That's the question. What is he going to get hit by? I think he's just backdashing him to stay out of range of everything. And then he's blocking the hell sweep. Beautiful oh, interception. That was big. Look at the damage here. Oh, gosh. Just like that. Yo, Kudon's at three rounds. 
straight for the first game. Will John didn't get three rounds straight for here in game two? We'll see. Anybody's match. Oh, but again, the round lead. This might be too much. A big counter hit goes for the hot play special and the follow-up. Yo, follow surprise! Up. Three rounds straight for John Ding. He's not done yet. Man, one game apiece. First to three here. Reset grand finals. John Ding and Kudon. I don't like to mention John Ding, he hasn't won a tournament yet, right? Not yet. This could be his big win. But again, he still has to deal with the reigning world champion. I feel like the longer or the more these sets go on, Kudan gets stronger and stronger. And that's typically historically how it's been. And typically historically how it's been is John Ding falls apart at the very end. Yeah, so let's see if something will be unwritten here. But again, it's tied up here, one match apiece. And it looks like we're going to the market stage. The Souk. Smaller stage, so he's going to be easier access to the wall, but also very restrictive for Eddie. So Eddie's going to have to be careful to not be pinned against the wall here. But if he keeps blocking everything, it's, it's going to work out. It doesn't matter at the end of the day. Oh, he's already tucking. Oh, God. He's already moving. It's okay. Kudos now. Low fairy. This is something we saw a lot in the first set when they met the first time in winners today. Yeah. Oh, and now the hell suits are starting to show up. Wow, he didn't even move in the Demon Corpse for us hit. Uh oh, got uh -huh. him again. Oh. Wow, it was surprising there that it didn't hit. Yeah, I mean, I think he was kind of ready for it too. Doesn't get a second kick, a slippery kick, but oh. denies the rage drive. And now, rage available for Kudan. Get oh, caught! Oh, big counter hit and the follow up. John Ding with the first round here. He's got the lead in the whole tournament grand final set now. Yeah, now finally overcoming the lead here. He's gonna have to hold on. Uh oh, goes into relax. Nice. Goes for the the block on the hell sweep again. Uh oh, this is gonna hurt. Last hit, extra damage. Yeah, he's testing Kudos now. Beautiful low parry again from Kudan. Like you mentioned last time, Kudan was ready. Starting the low parry, starting to buffer in that down forward. Yes, last kick off axis, uh -oh. and he tried to interrupt. Oh boy, John Ding with the back one. This is crazy now. If John Ding takes this lead, this lead, he's going to be in a situation where he can take one more game and be the champion. A huge comeback. Uh oh, again, went for a nice punish there for Kudan. Oh, Kudan is letting the wave who's go. Oh yeah, he's waking up. Oh, he caught him. That was beautiful. Three ring circuits in the middle of it. Nice. Oh, hell sweep. the delayed version of the oh, hell double. sweep. Oh, double. Oh, this time an elbow. Trying to challenge. Oh, oh, he went for it. Smart choice, Kudan. Staying in this bad position with the wall, though. He's got to be careful. Johnny still has rage now, not much help though, and Kudan's closing out the round. Yeah, he's the ability to duck that showing he's still very sharp here, still very aware. Two rounds to one though, still judging. This could be a big round if he takes it. The rate kick. Look, oh my gosh, Yo. great. Great stuff. Gets he's blocking on reaction, right? Maybe, I don't know. Can he see it on reaction? We're about to find out. Kind of refuse to believe it though, just concede because we saw that one match. Maybe that was a setup. Maybe he got hit by all the health sweeps as a as a long term uh, plan. Wow, he set him up that way. Maybe he took health sweeps all the first game. Uh oh, but they're hitting now. Oh, oh my Yo. god, this might be it. This could be it. Is he taking the lead in the set? He did. Yo, John Ding up two to one in the reset grand finals. One game away from winning the whole tournament. There's a lot of pressure now. Immense pressure on both of these players. I think the only person happy, or the only thing, the only group happy about this is UIU. Of course. But it's going to come down to this. This could be it. This might be where Junding takes his first victory on the TWT. What stage are we going to get? Might as well, let's put it, what do we have? Okay, we're in the Mishima oh, no. Dojo. Kudan's it's his yeah. home. Home field advantage here. It's not even like Devil Jin's home, it's Kudan's home. <laughs> <laughs> All right, he's gonna get the wall here. Let's see what he does with it. Hey, into the steel pedal, the flip over. Oh, uh -huh. the Unafraid. blender, it started. It's never gonna end at this point. 
Uh oh, this time challenging with the up forward four. I like that. This time hoping to eliminate the option, go for a safer poke, but also beat out the health in case he goes. Oh for my it. god, and John Day with a low parry this time. Oh, we're going to the other side here, gets the extra damage. Yeah, follow make up. up this life deficit that he was at. Nice beautiful. punish, he knew. Yeah, beautiful punish. Oh my gosh. And wow, the block didn't the time. He could have punished there, but he didn't commit to it. He's dodging some five with Kudos with the down forward one. All right. He's got the first round for once. Oh, nice. Gets the double hit there on the sidestep attack. Looking for that down forward two. I feel like down forward two has been underutilized in this so far because down forward two beats a ton of what Eddie's trying to go for. The pressure at the wall. Oh, oh way moves. Yo, See, Kudos. It's so scary to having to deal with that. Yeah, because you never know what's going to come out of it. Yeah, and you sometimes oh. you're ready, you know, you have to think and tell yourself, like, I'm going to do a launch punish. But then he does another low and kind of messes up your rhythm. Mm -hmm. Punish. Yes, sir. Kudos oh. with the wild standing, too. That's the first one. Yeah, he hasn't used it at all, just oh, like man. that. And that's Two the mix-up. Uh-oh. So now is it going to be Hell Sweep? Is it going to be wild standing, too? You never know. He's got the execution to pull it off. Usually the wild standing, too, out of the wave dash, hard to execute. But with Kudos, he's definitely got it down. Yeah, it's in his DNA. Uh-oh. Now spacing, looking again for these opportunities. Wraith kick this time. Junting fighting back. I mean, he's got you if he wants to win this tournament. He can't let this go to a final game. It's gonna, it's, it's too dangerous against someone like Kudos. Here we go, slippery kick. Yeah, it's not gonna kill, but it's gonna do this. Oh, oh my God, it's really missed. not gonna kill. Kudos with rage. He misses the hell sweep too far, and he tried another one. But okay, Junting staying alive. Two more rounds away from winning the tournament. Yeah, but again, Kudos can tie it up here. All he oh. needs is this round. Oh, nice. While standing four. Able to stop the pressure here. And you know, Junting has just been poking away, trying to create these opportunities. Oh, slash kick again. This time down four two, which is an amazing option. Safe. Get, gets a counter hit launch. Oh, man, he's done. Uh, that should be a huge tell here. Are we going to see the wave dash from Wall Standing 2 again? Oh, man. Oh, you never know, gosh. man. You never know. Oh, he interrupted. Nice interrupt with the jab there. Nice, good block there. Oh, Lazy Kramer, second attack and interrupted. Oh, he's in trouble now. Johnny's in big trouble. He got the rage up, gets stopped. That oh, sucked for him. Oh, yeah, that, and just like that. He doesn't even do extra damage anymore. Oh, oh but he got him. the man. That's going to be enough damage. We're going to go though? to a final round. That is definitely enough. Tournament point for John Ding. One round away. This is pivotal. This is going to be the biggest round of Rodeo, the tournament. Rodeo, no. Standing four. Little poke Did this bumper. stage always have this much base? It's Barbita rumbling. Uh oh, here we go. The pressure using the jabs now. Yeah, but yeah. again, Junting continuing to open up. He's using a lot of these low pokes. Oh, second hit this time for the down forward one. That twin Lancer. Uh oh, again. Got him out of there. No. Didn't commit, though. Oh, my God. This is so risky now. Kudan did a little bit of trouble. Oh, oh, he's got the slippery kick. This is big. He's going to do a lot of damage back to both. Wait, he's in the back. Again. Wall standing two on the back. Kudan's is converting with the electric into the wall. Here comes the wall combo. Bop. Another one. Oh, can he oh, close it out? Kudan closes it out and ties it up. John D was that one round of heck. Good and he get talks out of here. He talks to him. He thought you won the tournament. It's not over. Uh oh. It's not over. So it comes down to this. This is the final match of the tournament. It had to go down this way, of course. It's Tekken. Two to two. Reset grand finals. Kudos versus John Ding. Who do you guys want to see win? You guys want to see Kudos win? You guys want to see John Ding? Here we go. All right, looks like the crowd is in favor of John Ding. I'm still going to stand by my boy. And we are going to the Kinder Gym, a stage that rarely shows up. It showed him so much in the top eight. This is the John Ding stage, man. I'm telling you. It's his moment. I can feel it. All right, here we go. The crowd is getting hyped. Final match of the tournament. Round one. Let's go. Uh-oh, here we go. Again, continue with the low assault that we've seen so far from Junding. He's still chopping away at Kudans' ankles. Yeah, so good, you know, setting up his low from far away and then mixing up with the mids, but Kudans gets the flow combo to the wall. Hey. Nice, good stuff here. Uh-oh, and going the other way. Pressuring at the wall, they're about even on life. Yeah, Kudans immediately side steps away from that wall, though. Oh, yo, oh. got him. And one of the things you guys got to realize, this time going for the electric and now in rage. Oh, oh the slow gun fist. How this is he going to hurt big time. He might be, oh, what the hell was he, that? He put the brakes on. He had rage art available. He did go for it. 
Oh, but he got blown anyway! That's gonna be it. Oh, is it? Okay, he hits the range art this time. All right, Kudos pulling it back together. That was scary for a moment. Could have had the round early, but he closed it out to Rage Art anyway. First round, final game to Kudons. I have a bad feeling about this rep, too. Which way? We might have to say your famous tag. Oh, man, you know, I don't want four, this. 4 2. I'm just going to pay attention pop. to something else. Oh, man, what an amazing launch there. Good presence of mind there from Judging. Now he's going to push towards the wall, gets the low follow up. And again, Yo. look at this, the life deficit right now. Judding City pretty shouldn't oh take a risk. My. Oh, he dropped the combo. Yo, a nerf game to Kudos right now? It doesn't even matter. He's still getting this life back together. <laughs> he's getting his <laughs> life back together. <laughs> yeah, Tekken will do that to you, right? <laughs> oh, my he God. He became a player. He's in the grand finals reset. And John Dick tying it up. All right. Ruining this man's life. Yeah. The way of the Iron Fist sometimes just a bit too brutal. And again, still, these players looking for that opening. This time, extending the low there. This time to the Demon Pine. He's getting a lot of mileage out of it now. Yeah, using that uh, Wave Dash 3 and Slippery Kicks coming from John Ding. So now we know that the Slippery Kicks options, when not delayed, it's going to beat out that down forward 1 plus 2, and it's been working oh, out. Oh, sweet play. Oh, he wasn't ready. Oh, man, Kudos man, behind here. Round 3, counter back the one. The follow-up again. John Ding looking to go into the lead. Oh, Kudos. Yo. The rage kick. What's he gonna do? The one hit away? No! It's John Dig again! One round away from winning the tournament! Tournament point, here we go! But Kudon's with the jab like locked out. Kudon's not gonna go down without a oh, fight. Oh my, my god. god! How did that whip? John Dig makes it whip! I'm telling you, Kinder Jim gives him secret powers! And the wall, this is gonna hurt. It's a gym, bro! That's right! Oh, oh, he ducks it! That's big. He's gonna get the follow up here, pushing towards the wall. The side stun. Oh, the follow-up, what's he gonna do? Oh, he missed the Demon Steel Metal, oh, back foot you for the punish. Yo, this is a reset, Grand Finals, John Ding trying to win the tournament. Can he do it here? Big oh, block, big, big punish! punish. Kudos, is it gonna happen? We're going to a final, final round! It all comes down to this. Everything is in motion, what's oh gonna happen? Oh my god, the, the arena is rumbling right now! Oh, good block, he's gonna get a conversion. No, he no. didn't! He was just too far for it. Oh my god, can John Ding close it out for once? Oh man, he didn't even punish that! Like, the hell oh, we missed! They're finally coming out! He's oh gonna my god, he's gonna save the wall too! Mix up, what's he gonna do? Demon Paw! John Ding way behind! He's got the rage! He's gotta make a rage come back now! Oh, oh the rage! Oh, gonna hit! The wall's, right the wall's right there! The wall's right there! What's he gonna do? 50-50! He got oh, blocked! He gets punched right! Shining fist. That's not he's breaking! John oh Ding wins the tournament! John Ding with CEO 2018 here in Daytona! The crowd is going wild! I don't think I've ever seen a spring kick win it like that. An emphatic victory for John Ding. Oh my god. What a tournament! That was some good ass Tekken. That was some hella good ass Tekken! Oh my wow. god! Shout out to John Ding! First place! First victory for the Tekken World Tour in his illustrious Tekken career. Also, round of applause for Kuna, finishing in second place here tonight. Third place, of course, Echo Fox and JDCR. Oh man, what a great event. Yo, and fourth place, giving up a little margin. Yeah, our top placer here in America, but man, that was some good stuff. Yeah, look at him, taking in the moment. Man, he had to work for that. He definitely How many tournament to points did he have? That was crazy. It doesn't matter now, because he got a lot. <laughs> Woo! Give him the look. Give him the look. Let him know. What kind of threat? <laughs> Man. Now, Rip, this has been a pleasure. Of course, the Tekken World Tour, not done yet. There is still more uh. events on the way. The next master event is going to be happening in Birmingham in the United Kingdom. And that's going to be happening in the middle of July. Then after that, we have two events happening in August. We have the Tokyo Tekken Masters event in Japan. And then following that, we have Summer Jam taking place just outside of Philadelphia. Man. It never stops. Never stops. It's not going to stop. But of course, we're going to Amsterdam, of course. That's what these guys are playing for, right? Yeah. Free trip to Amsterdam for the global finals. Yeah. December 1st and 2nd. We're going to find out who is going to be this year's world champion. It's crazy because now we don't even know who is in contention for this. We have Kudans, who's been winning. JDCR, you can never count him out. Never. John Ding now at the pinnacle, at the top here. What about me? You forget about that knee guy? He's waiting in the shadows, bro. He's <laughs> not course. even here. It's crazy. This, this Maybe tour is he's so backstage stacked. and he has a steel chair. Oh, dude, the music's going <laughs> to... We're going to go off the air and just... Glass going to break. Knee's going to walk out here. I, I hope so. Make it happen.
It's going to be tight, man. We hope you guys had a good time here. This, of course, CEO Daytona 2018. Yeah. Man, this tour has been crazy so far. Yeah, and again, like I was saying, the top eight, man, I could have gone either way. Obviously, both of these players very used to each other. They played in each other in tournament before, but man, the clutch there at the very end, the there are so many things that happened that it could have gone either way. So many drops, so many weird situations, and the scrambles and just coming out on top, man, John Ding able to earn that first victory in his Tekken 7 tournament career here at the Tekken World Tour. Yeah, looks like the players are lining up for the award ceremony, of course. Man, I forgot Jimmy J. Tran was in this tournament. That yeah. was so long ago. <laughs> yeah, it's been a fun, fun, fun evening, of course. And John Ding, he's going to get himself that nice belt, but we're going to go down and award these guys their medals and herald them for their victory. I don't know about the rest of you, but that felt like some good ass Tekken. Today at CEO 2018, these eight players have achieved greatness. And in seventh place, Bin Chang. Also in seventh place, Jimmy J. Tran. In fifth place, Alpha Red's book. Also in fifth place, Equinox Dimeback. In fourth place, ITS Lil Majin. In third place, Echo Fox's JDCR. In second place, UIU q -dons. And for the first time in his career, a second world tour, master event, grand champion, John Day! Please give it up for the CEO 2018 Tekken 7 Top 8. Wow. All right, guys, it's been an amazing night of Tekken. And again, I can't wait to do this again. We'll see you mm -hmm. guys, of course at upcoming master events, but you guys can see these amazing players who put on an amazing show for us. And Rip, I gotta say, man, I enjoyed this. It's always fun to do commentary with you. Uh, Every probably time. probably won't be able to sleep well tonight. Well, I mean, I'll be able to sleep, but I won't be able to speak for a while. You, know? you, go. <laughs> you gotta get my voice back. It's gonna be a crazy couple weeks, man. Of course, everything leading up to EVO, just in a few weeks away as well. Yeah, which is uh, shaping up to probably be another one of the biggest Tekken tournaments in history, right. which I can't wait for, of course. Just a month away, right? Yeah. Just about. Yeah, just about early it's August. almost that time. But again, I want to thank everybody, especially Alex Jabaley. I hate to give him credit, but and the CEO staff for putting on an amazing event. Shout out to Tenno Productions for, again, making us look good and making Tekken look amazing. And is there anything you want to say to the Tekken fans? Nah, man, just as always, continue supporting the game, continue supporting the community. We will see you guys next time. Peace out.